Hey everyone! In this video, I'll show you how to completely leave the Windows Insider program and go back to the stable public version of Windows 11, step by step. If you joined the Insider program 2 or even 10 days ago, updated the system 2 or 3 times, or you're in the beta, dev, or canary channel, and now the unenrollment option is grayed out or the go back option doesn't work anymore, this is the complete solution. Let's start. First, try this simple method from settings. Here's how to roll back to the stable version of Windows. Go to System. Then Recovery. Under Recovery Options, click Go Back or Go Back to the previous version of Windows. Here is the option grayed out I already done, this option work one time. After Rollback, open Windows Update then Windows Insider Program. Click Stop Getting Preview Builds. Turn on Unenroll this device when the next version of Windows releases. If these options are grayed out or don't work, don't worry, follow the next steps. Step 1. Go to the official Insider website, insider.windows.com slash leave dash program. And click on this link. Sign in with the same Microsoft account you used for Insider and click leave the program. This removes your Microsoft account from the Insider program and stops Insider emails. Step 2. Next, open Settings, go to Accounts, then Email and Accounts. Select the account link to your device and click Manage. Sign in if asked, then go to your Microsoft account online. Open Devices, and remove your PC from the list. After that, return to Settings, Open Accounts, then Your Info, and choose Sign In with a local account instead. If that option isn't available, create another local account. Finally, sign out of your Microsoft account and restart your PC. Step 3. After restart, if the Insider program still shows up, we'll do a manual cleanup. Press Windows plus R, type Regedit, and press Enter. Navigate to this path. Right-click the folder Windows Self-Host, then select Delete. Close Registry Editor and restart your PC. Now, to confirm you're fully out, Press Windows plus R. Type Winver. And check the build number. If it shows something like 22631.XXX, that's a public, stable, build. You can also check it in settings. If it says, get started, congratulations, you've completely left the Insider program and will now only receive stable Windows updates. Step 4. Sometimes, even after leaving, Windows Update keeps downloading an Insider build. To stop it, press Windows plus R, type services.msc, press Enter. Find Windows Update and Background Intelligent Transfer Service, bits. Right-click each stop. Then press Windows plus R again, type, C colon backslash Windows backslash soft TWA redistribution. Delete everything inside that folder. These are temporary update files, safe to remove. Go back to services, right click Windows update and bits. Start again. Now open settings then click on check for updates. You should see only public updates, not insider previews, if still show issues troubleshoot the update, and that's it. You fully removed your PC and account from the Windows Insider program and stopped all insider updates. If this solution does not resolve your problem reinstall fresh Windows 11 latest version 25H2, download it from Microsoft Download Center, if this video helped, hit like, subscribe, and drop a comment with your channel, dev, beta, canary, or release preview. I'll help you with the best method for your case.